Hi there. So in this video, we're going to take a look at how to create test case in Catalan Studio. So first thing, go to Catalan Studio and download the installer. And it's basically Eclipse IDE and then extract in one of your systems folder and then run Catalan.exe in case if you are on Windows, in case you are on Mac or say Linux, then the process may slightly differ because you have to extract that specific um, compressed file and then execute this Ketlin. Okay, so now that Ketlin Studio is open, you can create new project. Okay, so what I've done is simply go to file menu, then new, and then project. Now here, I'm going to create, let's say, a project named Devnami, and I'm going to use this project for the rest of the videos, okay? Now that once it gets created, in Test Explorer, it will create few folders, test cases, object repository, suits, data files, checkpoints, keywords, and reports. So go to Test Cases, and then right-click, and then New, and then test cases. I'm going to make first test case with name test case 1. Okay, now click OK and it will create it here. And here you can see it is immediately open in one of the tabs. Now here for item column here, you will need to add web UI keyword. And it will point you to some of the operations that you can do so first thing we are going to do is open browser so we'll go to the o so here is open browser now i need to do the second step which is going to be navigate to a specific url okay so navigate to url and i want to show catalan studio that i need to specifically go to google.com okay you can also go to any other website let's say i choose to go to wikipedia.org okay now click on okay next thing i want to right click here again add web ui keyword and then get the window title so check get window title Okay. Now that title will be visible in our console log. Okay. So finally, we need to add one more step, which is going to be close browser. Okay. So these are basically four steps through which we are running this test case. Go to Wikipedia org, then get a window title of that web page, and finally close it. Okay. You can add some level of delay if you want, but this is very simple test, so I'm not adding any delay or so, and I'm going to show you simply how to execute that test case. So for running the test case, check the top option here, run, then choose the browser out of it from this drop down. Choose Chrome or Firefox or Internet Explorer, Safari, Edge, etc choose chrome for this test okay because chrome engine is installed on my machine so i'm choosing that it will open one instance of chrome okay and it will navigate to wikipedia.org and it will wait till it loads completely or maybe it will even stop and then it will directly the test is done okay that's why you need to add a delay in between close and previous steps okay so now let's come to this part log viewer okay so for log viewer you can see how much time each test step has taken okay as you can see one second point one two nine seven seven okay now to see the window title, go to console 
and here you see past current windows title is wikipedia okay it will also show you which test is passed or if there is any fail or etc in log you can see none of the test is failed okay so this was simple test case uh, that you can run through kitlen studio okay so this was a short video on how to create a test case and how to execute test case in one of the browser engine with Kitlen Studio. Okay.